Hey guys, what's going on? It's Lens here and today we have another review for you. What do we have here today? Something that I don't review often, but we always sleep on this brand. It is Airy Offline Real Me Crossover Flowy Short. I love reviewing shorts because they're so hard to find, especially if you have bigger legs, smaller waist, we're all unique. I like to see, are they worth it? Do they fit? What's the deal here? But before I get into it, don't forget, I link everything up below when you shop directly from my links. It does help support my YouTube channel and I appreciate that so much. What color did I end up getting? I went with a basic black. We can never go wrong with having black shorts. Black leggings are so versatile. However, they have a bunch of fun colors. They have like a teal color, pink, white, and then like kind of a red color, which I love. Also a different color of a brown. So we got a lot of options here. I went ahead and got a size medium because that is the size that I wear in a lot of different leggings and spandy shorts. So I went with a size medium. One thing that I really like about this is the waistband, which is why I wanted to try these on. So as soon as I pulled these out of the packaging, Ooh, they are soft. The waistband itself is stretchy, which I like because again, if we're a little bit of a different size in the waist, we have a little wiggle room and it allows to be super comfortable where you can like wear them all day. The waistband's really soft and then the material itself here is also soft not scratchy feeling at all. Then we have spandex shorts under, which we'll get into here in a moment. As soon as I put these on, they fit like a glove. So the size medium was a perfect size. If I would have went with the size small, I think they would have been too short. The spandex shorts under would have been too tight. So a size medium was good for me and my body. You can check out my stats below and kind of compare where you're at to see what size would be best for you. Now, as far as the waistband, it has a front crossover. So does it pass the high waistband test? It does ever so slightly hit above my belly button because we have that slight V down. So it's right where my belly button is. But the thing that I like is that it's double layered and this cross over here comes, it's not sewn on. So it allows for a little bit more flexibility in your waist. And then also it still holds you in. Both of these are going to be double layered, which is nice. And we have a nice little hold in in the lower belly area, which is what I like. Now the V up is amazing because typically it kind of hugs in the waist area and it gives us a nice curve. That's why I wanted to try these on and it did that. It was super comfortable around the waist and then it kind of elongates the upper hip area on the side. So I really like the waistband in the front and how it looks. Now, as far as the seams go, we do have a front seam, not a huge deal because these are like normal shorts. We're not talking about spandex shorts. Wasn't annoyed with that at all. Then as we turn to the side, this is where I'm gonna go over the spandex under the shorts. Typically, I'm not a big fan of that because they ride up. However, this length is a little bit shorter than other shorts that I've had that have this spandex under the short themselves. So with that, it didn't really pinch my legs too much. It was the right fit there, which obviously I really like that it wasn't too tight on my legs. Then we have side pockets under the flyaway part of the short on both sides. This pocket's big enough to fit my iPhone in, so that's perfect. And then on the other side, you can put some snacks, you can put your key fob, your credit card, whatever you wanna do on the other side. So we have pockets in these shorts, which is amazing. As we move to the back, I also love the booty part because we have a V in the back as well. So we have that different textured waistband. It's similar to like the same texture waistband that you would get in a legging. That's this waistband here. So we have a V up, which I like because it makes the backside look super cute. And then we do have like a little sun, kind of like their offline logo in the back, but you can't really see it because it blends right in. It's also black. The other thing that I wanna make note is the length. The length of these shorts I'm very comfortable in. They're not too short and they're not too long. I hate when shorts are too long because it makes me look even shorter. I would feel comfortable going on a walk in these, going to the grocery store. They're very versatile short with how they fit me and my body. I really do like the leggings under the short because they are technically fly away. So they do offer more coverage and make you feel more held in, in that glute and hip area. If you guys have any questions or would like me to review any shorts that you see floating around, let me know below in the comments. Until next time, we'll talk to you guys later.